Welcome to section 3, trying out some different scikit-learn algorithms. In this section, we'll explore few of the machine learning algorithms that are available with scikit-learn. We'll learn about Naveways classification algorithm and how to use scikit-learn's Naveways classifier for machine learning. We'll learn about support vector machines and how to build machine learning models using SBM. And we'll explore how to use and visualize decision tree classifiers. Welcome to the first video of this section using Naveways classification algorithm. In this video, we'll learn about the scikit-learn's implementation of Naveways classification algorithm. We'll learn about and how to use Gaussian Naveways scikit-learn's submodule. We'll explore multinomial Naveways classification classes and we'll also learn about Bernoulli Naveways classifier. Naveways algorithm is a supervised classification technique based on Bayes' theorem with an assumption of independence among predictors. Naveways simplifies the calculation of probabilities by assuming that the probability of each attribute belonging to a given class value is independent of all other attributes. This is a strong assumption but results in a fast and effective method. In simple terms, a Naveways classifier assumes that the presence of a particular feature in a class is unrelated to the presence of any other feature. Even if these features depend on each other or upon the existence of other features, all of these properties independently contribute to the prediction and that is why it is known as Nave. Naveways model is easy to build and particularly useful for very large datasets. Along with its simplicity, Naveways is known to outperform even highly sophisticated classification methods. As we learn, Gaussian and B classes implement the Gaussian Naveways algorithm. Gaussian likelihood refers to the conditional likelihood of feature values given a class label as approximated by the conditional distribution fitted to that feature during training. To be more specific, the likelihood is the height of that distribution's probability density. It's called a Gaussian likelihood because the standard Gaussian Nave based classifier models all continuous features using Gaussian distributions. For Naveways, Askelearn has a submodule called Nave underscore base. We are here importing the classes for all the three Naveways implementations from this submodule. We then load in the Iris dataset from the Askelearn datasets. Next, we instantiate the Gaussian Naveways model by calling the Gaussian NB class. We train this model with the iris data by calling the fit me method. We then call the predict method to make our predictions. And finally, we are here measuring the accuracy of the model by calling the accuracy score method. Next up is multinomial Naveways. Multinomial NB is the Naveways classifier for multinomial models and implement the Naveways algorithm for multinomial distributed data. The multinomial Naveways classifier is suitable for classification with discrete features. The multinomial distribution normally requires integer feature counts. Let's look at the code for instantiating and training a multinomial Naveways model. We use the Escalons multinomial NV class to instantiate a multinomial Naveways model. We imported this earlier in this Jupyter Notebook. We train this model with the iris data by calling the fit method. And finally, we call the predict method to make our predictions. Next and the final classifier we'll look at is Bernoulli Naveways classifier. Bernoulli NV is this Ascal Scikit-Learn's Naveways classifier for multivariate Bernoulli model. Bernoulli NV is suitable for discrete data and it is designed for binary Boolean features. In the multivariate Bernoulli event model, features are independent. Like the multinomial model, this model is popular for document classification tasks. Let's look at the code for building a model with Bernoulli Naveways model. We use the scikit-learn's Bernoulli and we class to instantiate a Bernoulli Naveways model. We imported this earlier in this Jupyter notebook. We train the model with our data and we then call the predict method to make our predictions. In this video, we learned about the scikit-learn's implementation of Naveways classification algorithm. We learned about and how to use Gaussian NV 
scikit-learn's Gaussian nave base implementation. We explored multinomial nave base classification classes, and we also learned about Bernoulli and B classifiers. We also saw how to write code for using these classifiers.